What's up guys, it's your boy Gong. Welcome back to another mod review video. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the MAN TGS tanker pack and the BM Volvo 620-640 by um, North Modding Company. The MAN TGS is by West Modding. Um, I did notice something looking in the Xbox mod hub. It was not called the BM Volvo, it was called the Voivo, I guess. But it's still located on um, um, North Modding Company and all of that stuff if you're searching my brand. So... First off, let's take a look at the MAN TGS. So, if you, let me turn on my help window really quickly. So, if you go into store, you go over to trucks. It's going to be under vehicles, under trucks. All the way over here. Base cost is $183,000. Um, based on this, it says it has 300 and Sorry, 353 kilowatts or 480 horsepower. Um, top speed is 49 miles per hour. The capacity of the tank on this one is 8,000. Um, initial slot counts. Give me one second. Let me get rid of this and I'll tell you what it is. Initial slot count is going to be 38. That's a lot. Um, this is actually, a, you know, carry all the, I guess, all the, f the, f the f liquids in the game. So fuel, water, that looks like milk, herbicide, and fertilizer. Um, if you go in there, you have the three color options as always. Um, then you have wheel brand, trailer board, lizard, Nankian, back to trailer board. Trailer board has wide tires. Um, you have the standard design. You have the Lion, which, let's see what that changed. Oh, you put that Lion sticker on the side. I guess that says stripes. I guess it puts those stripes on the, the strips on the front. Strips and Lion, which is all, and then back to standard. Um, cab, you have Cab M. You have Extension M, which puts that thing on the back by where you saw the exhaust. You have cab M extension M is just both of those. Um, engine setup you have TG TGS 2.2 I'm 26.4806 um, x 0.50, which gives you an increase to 500 horsepower back to 4.8. So those are the basic options in there. Let's go ahead and purchase that. <clears throat> Next for this, you have an attachment for the um for the back. For it's like a, I guess it's a extended um, tanker. That is going to be located under animals. It's the MKS8. That's an additional capacity of 8,000. Slot counts is going to be 10. Initial purchase cost is 25,000. Now, I should note that the entire pack of Mod Hub, including the, the truck itself, download size is going to be 13.62. And this also carry the same liquids, gas, water, all of that stuff. So go ahead and purchase that. Two, you have two options in your rim color and main color. You have wheel brand, lizard nankian, li back to lizard, design one, which is plain. Design two, what did that change? I'm not seeing what the design actually changes. Yeah, I'm not actually see what that changes. So you have plate configuration, no, and then yes, and I think that just puts a plate in the back, no, and yes, and that's basically it. Um, I do believe that there's actually there's actually a plate setting for the truck as well, but that's basically what it is. Let's see what the truck sounds like. And Xbox is going to be RB and X. typical sound let's see if there's any for reverse there's a sound for reverse then let's do the horn that's going to be R, B, and A alright so it's a typical truck sound so 
let's go ahead and um, attach to this trailer up here. So just pull in front. Xbox, I'm guessing it, it's just, it should just give you an option to do it. There you go. A. And um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go test out from the store what we can actually purchase as a liquid. So if we push the left joystick in, you have liquid fertilizer, herbicide, water, back to liquid fertilizer. Um, I do have a gas station. I just want to test it out really quickly just to ensure that it gives you all the, the fluids needed. I think the total capacity with this, um, the main tanker and the additional tanker is going to be about 16,000. Um, 16,000, yeah. 16, 8 plus 8,000 is 16,000. Um, what are we feeling? Can I not fill these here? Oh, I don't think I can actually fill these here. I should be able to. Let's, see, let's try this one. So I don't think I can actually fill this at this gas station, but you get the basic gist of what this tanker does. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to cut and we're going to look at the, um, the Voiva or the Volvo, whatever you want to call it. All right, so in the store, it's located under vehicles on a wheel loader because that's technically what it is. Slot counts are going to be 12 for the initial purchase. Um, 65 horsepower, 16 miles per hour. Um, that's basically it. So let's go ahead and purchase that. Let's do wheel brand. You, know, you can't change the color on this one. Wheel brand is 640, 620, back to 640. Wheel setup is standard. Wide tires. Pro Grip F, Pro Grip All. So I guess in the Pro Grip F was for just the front, Pro Grip All, back to standard. Next thing you have is um, fender configurations. You have option one, which gives you those fenders right there. Option two, which gives you some angular fenders and more square. And back to standard. Guard configuration is standard. Sides. Oh, okay. So the, the guards, I guess, is for the front. So, so side, it puts the guards on the side of that bottom which is the bottom glass as you can see there side plus bottom and then all then back to standard um big warning triangle yes or no i am guessing that's gonna be on the back yep it's on the back beacon configuration yes or no those are the only two options and then that's back to standard so that's basically all the options there are for this Go ahead and purchase it and let's hear what it sounds like. Alright, sounds kinda sounds kinda cheap. Let's back up. There's no sounds on the reverse and then let's do the point. All right, so it has like a car sounding horn. So that's basically it for this one in terms of how it sounds and stuff. Let's go ahead and look at the attachments. So if we go to tools and look for wheel loaders, you go all the way over. These are the two options that are there. You have the standard bucket, which is three slots, $700, and it holds 
all of the, the, the crops, the solids and those stuff, manure, all of those things. You have the pallet fork, which is for one slot and it lifts pallets. And that's basically, let's see, let me just purchase it just to see how it attaches, make sure all that works as well. All right. So pull up to it, hit A, attaches. RB and the right joystick, pushing it to the left or the right tilts the bucket forwards and backwards. Moving it up, moves the bucket up, moving it down, moves the bucket down. So that's basically it. Oh, I took up some room. All right, guys. So if you guys did like the video, please go ahead and hit the like button. If you want to stay up to date what's going on, please go ahead and subscribe. And if you have any tips, comments, suggestions that you want to leave below, please go ahead and leave them. I'll get back to each and every one of you. And I um, apologize for the way I sound in this video. I... Um, been having some breathing issues. I'm just trying to get through it, trying to push some videos out. And I thank you guys again for all the continued support.